Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today what I wanted to do was do something different. Hence why I didn't do anything to my hair because it's just a frizzy hot mess and I didn't want to bother doing anything. It's just one of those days where I don't really care how I look on camera. Whatever. I don't care. Um, anyway, before I ramble on, uh, what I wanted to do was, um, give myself a different look. Now, um, I want to try giving myself freckles. Now, I don't want to do like the henna because I like didn't want to smell weird. So, I went and picked up some bronzer, not bronzer, self tanner. And I'm like, okay, that could be fun. And I saw Naomi John do it and I love how it turned out. I'm like, why the fuck not? And I'm gonna try it. So I'm just gonna get into it. So I'm going to take the San Tropez self tanner in dark. So I'm going to take on like a paper plate, you don't have to put it on a paper plate, you could put it like in a bowl, but I just found what was in reach happened to be there. So I'm just gonna pour it. I don't want to get my hand orange. I know it would work better if I had the mousse and whatnot, but yeah. Um, so in true dark fashion, I can't find my brush. <sighs> Let me find my brush and I will be right back. All right, so I found it. Okay, um, I don't know how to go about this, so I'm overwhelmed. I'm just going to take my mirror and I'm going to take just a cheap elf brush and I'm going to take the eyebrow pencil on that side. I'm going to pick some up on that end. And work it where I shouldn't have put glitter on my eye, but I'll worry about that later. I'm like, I might look like a total fucking retard, but I wanted to do it. I'm bored. And just felt like making myself look like a complete, like, ding a -ling. That one's gonna be dark. And, like, I should have looked up a reference picture, but I'm too f***ing lazy at the moment to want to give So, yeah. And, like,
This is kind of relaxing, to be honest. See, like, I feel like I did good right here, but then, like, I don't know what's happening here. I feel like I'm wearing a mask. I don't know. But, like, I want it to be natural AF looking. All right. This frizzy hair needs to get out of my fucking <laughs> face. So, like... The good thing about this is, I have... Blemishes. Easy fix. Let's... Let's cover it. <coughs> I know, I should win Miss Teen Pregnancy for how I look right now. They're gonna ask me, what did you win an award for? Um, spending like 20 fucking years putting these freckles on for you bastards. Better give me a fucking crown. I feel like they look like injection marks. Uh. Looks like I have chicken pox. But let's continue. All right, so I want to say that's it for right now. All right. This is it. I'm going to leave this on for however long the however long the self tanner says for. Allow 48 hours before to get wet. Wait until touch dry before getting dressed. Hold 20 30 centimeters away. Whoops. Hmm. Okay. Well. Doesn't say anything about that. Um, I'm gonna let this dry and um, yeah. Should have done like a before so you could see, but doesn't really fucking matter now. All right, um, I'll check back with you guys in a little bit, and, um, 
let you guys know. But so far, this is what it looks like. Yep. Looks orange, I know. Hold your comments, I know. Oompa Loompa, here I come. Alrighty. Hello, everyone. Um, doing a check-in. I just came out of the shower, so, I mean, mind my baldness that's happening at the moment. I mean, it's what happens when, you know, I color my hair 15,000 times. Anyway, um, so this is what it looks like now that I washed my face. I didn't use like a gritty face scrub when I did it, um, just because I wanted to see how it would look. I mean, number one, like for freckles, okay, I could see it. And like, I don't know what I was thinking to like outline my lips with the self-tanner. It looks fucking stupid. But what I do want to, what I do want to do, what I do want to do, I literally didn't get any sleep. What I want to do is go in again and like not do such big spots because see how it faded? Like, I wonder what it would look like if I went in again with like a smaller amount and like I put on the Anastasia tint brow. So, I mean, your best bet is self-tanner, but I'm probably going to mix Jergens because it is like a lotion. So I'm gonna mix that with the Saint Tropez and um, I'll see you when it's application time. And a quick disclaimer why I think it didn't work. Well, it did work, but um, in the clip prior to this one, I put on my face the Lexiton Aqua and I think that had something to do with it and I'm going to try it differently this time as like a cl clean canvas. And no, I'm not topless. I'm sorry. I am in a towel. But check in times one. Let's see how application times two will go. Like, look how faint that is. Ew. All right. Um, I'll see you in the next clip. All right, I had to give that one a break because that was very traumatizing to me because I honestly don't know why. But um, it's nice to know what I would look like if I was extremely masculine. But I'm also petrified because I like being overly, not overly, but I like my feminine features. And I don't like who would want this jawline. Not me. Not me. It's... Oh. 
Okay, but on a serious note, can anyone take me seriously anymore? Because, um, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Like, I feel like this one is worse. Worse. Like, it makes me look like I'm 12. But anyway, this is my first Snapchat. I'm 12 years old. I I go to fifth grade. Yeah, and yeah. Like, what would my if name? I didn't have the name Derek. That would be an interesting video. Uh, okay, but on a serious note, this is my face up moment. <sighs> yep. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. And I'll see you all later. Bye.